those of you who would like to mark your catalogs in the Jersey Spring Heifer Calf class, entry 1582 was 12th, entry 1583 was 14th, and second junior, W.H. Verbatim D., exhibited by Logan and Jordan Elmore of Elizabethtown, Kentucky. Entry 1584 was 19th, 1585 was 8th, 1589 was your winning entry, Meadow Ridge Roosevelt Susie, exhibited by Roger Reby and Jean Henderson of Cumberland, Wisconsin. 1592 was second and best bred and owned. Meadow Ridge Roosevelt Taylor, exhibited by Mark Reby of Cumberland, Wisconsin. 1593 was 18th. 1594 was 15th. 1595 was your third place entry. Crossbrook Minister Charity, exhibited by Fontaine, Purple Fever, Sherm, and Miller of Louisville, New York. 1596 was 6th, 1597 was 13th, and first junior, Miss Nevada Lexus, exhibited by Brad and Brian Arthur of Maynard, Iowa. 1598 was 11th, 1600 was 10th, 1602 was 17th, 1603 was 4th, 1604 was 16th, 1605 was 7th. In your added entries, 2957 was 5th, 2962 was 9th, and 2973 was 20th. The class now in the ring are the Winter Heifer Calf class. The first place award is presented by K&R Jerseys of Rushford, Minnesota. Junior award is presented by Bob and Molly Yan of Blue Mounds, Wisconsin. Judge Van Axel has completed his placings in the Jersey Winter Heifer Calf class. We'd like to recognize our juniors, so please take a step forward. Our second place junior goes to entry 1611, W.H. Verbatim Newell, exhibited by Logan and Jordan Elmore of Elizabethtown, Kentucky. First junior goes to entry 1606, Pyramid Plus Jada, exhibited by Caitlin Abbott of Fairfield, Vermont. Our best bred and own goes to entry 2898, Parkview Verbatim Holy Smokes, exhibited by Parkview Jerseys and Patty Jones of Louisville, New York. Third place in the class went to entry 1612, Sleager Home Tequila Sunrise, exhibited by South Mountain Jerseys, Ernest Kiefner and Terry Packard of Litchfield, Connecticut. Second place is entry 1622, Stars Valiant Choice, exhibited by Connor Hill of Fayetteville, Arkansas. And your winning entry, entry 1620, Meadow Ridge King Megan, exhibited by Roger Reby and Jean Henderson of Cumberland, Wisconsin. Congratulations. Judge your comments. A tremendous class here in the intermediate calf class, and in saying that, I think we have a rather handy winner. Hefford excels over the rest of the class in her style and balance and symmetry. She's got a, a advantage over the heifer in second, especially in the rump region today in the loin. She's a stronger loin heifer, and when you view her from the rear, she's wider, thorough, wider pins with a tail head setting more neatly into those pins. But I do love the style that this heifer in second possesses and that beautiful front end. She uses that front end to go over another stylish individual in third. She's much deeper in the heart, fuller up over the crops and right at the shoulder, and just a little more breed character and more strength in the jaw than the beautiful, well-balanced heifer here in third. This is a tremendously well-balanced and easy-moving heifer. I give her advantage over the heifer in fourth in that regard. She's a, a heifer that when you see her track from the rear, she tracks much nicer on a straighter set of feet and legs. But I do love this heifer in fourth. She, as soon as she calmed down, you really got a chance to look at her, and she's an extremely well-balanced heifer. And I give her advantage over the heifer in fifth in the rump region. She's a heifer that's wider and cleaner in the pins with a tail setting more neatly into there. Two very similar heifers in fifth and sixth. Heifers that you like for their extension and their breed character. But a tremendous class all the way through. Thank you.